From time immemorial, the realms have been locked in mortal combat. Blood has been shed, and lives taken in an epic battle between darkness and light. ago, Shinnok rebelled against them. He tried to kill his fellow Elder Gods and annihilate the realms. defeated, Shinnok was cast out of the heavens. He was stripped of his divine power and imprisoned in the nether realm. Shinnok has plotted his revenge and his return ever since. The realms must now beware, for he has found the means to do both. If you don't like our terms, Baraka, go. Your offer is unacceptable. Tarkata will starve. Better half a loaf than none at all. I am under no obligation to allow your tribe on my land. Your land, Shiva. All lands are Shao Kahn's. Do you forget that he favors my people over yours? Need I remind you why? It's Scorpion from the tournament. Quan Chi's servant. Quan Chi? State your business, Netherrealmer. I am here for the Mask of Drumming. Yeah. <sighs> 
are both bold and foolish, Scorpion. No one steals from the Shokan. Only one obstacle remains between Scorpion and Dramin's mask. Shiva, Queen of the Shokan. Scorpion defeats her in an epic battle, then lays hands on the object of his quest. As he grabs the mask, however, he's overwhelmed by its dark power. He's battered by visions of his past, battles with the Lin Kuei, the death of his family and clan, and his rebirth as a Netherrealm Wraith. The emotional onslaught knocks him unconscious. Shiva, now having recovered from combat, eyes Scorpion with disdain. She orders him taken to Shao Kahn. would he have to do that? You are a mere plaything to him. Your life no longer serves his schemes. There's no reason not to end it. Now, why we still train? <sighs> that was a lucky strike. Let's go again. I will show you. No, Kung Lao. The training you require is mental, not physical. What do you mean, Liu Kang? You cannot surpass your limitations until you acknowledge them.
It is unclear how Shinnok discerned the importance of Draman's mask and the other relics. The Elder Gods went to great lengths to hide knowledge of them from him. We must collect the relics and break them. Doing so will not help. The power they hold, like the Elder Gods themselves, is indestructible. Our only hope is to sequester them in the Temple of the Elements. It would help if we knew what they all are. You got a list? These are the relics we seek. I know where to find them. All right then. This'll be easy peasy. Several of the relics are in Shao Kahn's possession. Ah, not so peasy. We must divide our forces. Recover the relics as quickly as possible. What can the SF do? Augment the Shaolin's defenses at the Temple of the Elements. Once your soldiers are in place, you and Sonya Blade can join the search. Understood. Johnny Cage. Yes, your thunderousness? Both the Sundo Hearthstone and the Crown of Jared are held by Shao Kahn. You and Fujin will travel to Outworld to retrieve them. <sighs> Terrific. I'm telling you, we're gonna be perp-walked into the Colosseum and our heads used for target practice. Have faith, Johnny. Our fight isn't over. It isn't? Great. Well, I guess it's showtime. to gawk at the monkeys, princess? Or have you brought us our last meal? If you could remain quiet for one moment, you'd learn that I'm here to help. Why would you help us, princess? I've been having doubts about my father since the tournament. You Earthrealmers were not the devils he portrayed you to be. His pact with Shinnok is the last straw. You must go, now, and quickly. But we cannot leave for Earthrealm without the crown of Jared and the Sundo Hearthstone. Leave the crown to me. The Hearthstone is at Shang Tsung's island. The fastest way there is by ship. Take the mighty Onaga, which is docked at Rain's Cove. Princess, I could kiss you. If you try, you'll find your teeth on the floor.
What's he getting? The usual? No, we need to go to town on him this time. He's pissed way too many people off. What the shit? Get everybody out here, now! all day. As his soldiers take the Black Dragon Ruffians prisoner, Commander Jackson Briggs smirks with satisfaction. <laughs> it is mission accomplished yet again. Or so he thinks. Without warning, more Black Dragon attack. Led by Aaron Black, they rush in, guns blazing. Still enraged by the deaths of his comrade, Commander Briggs turns his attention to Frost. She is not the least bit intimidated by Jackson's anger, for she knows something that he does not. The vile purpose for which the factory was built. Frost throws a switch, bringing the factory to life. It soon begins churning out Cyber Lin Kuei. These autonomous warriors, devoid of compassion or mercy, are the ultimate killing machines. <laughs> <laughs> 